Not only will Kansas City crown a volleyball national champion Saturday night, the Division II football championship will be decided here as well at Children's Mercy Park. A lot of options to do this weekend, lots going on. Members of the Texas A&M Commerce football squad are taking time out of their schedule, their practice schedule, to visit with veterans at the VA hospital in Kansas City. And our Rob Collins uh, is there with more this morning at the hospital. Rob, good morning. Hey Nick, hey guys, good morning. Yeah, the Texas A&M Commerce football team has arrived here at the Kansas City VA Hospital. They're going to meet veterans and greet them as part of the community outreach that teams do when they come to play for the Division II title here in Kansas City. Head coach Kobe Carthel joins us this morning. Coach, uh, thanks for joining us. I appreciate that. Welcome to Kansas City. I appreciate it, Rob. Glad to be here. You betcha. Uh, tell us about this outreach, what it means for you and your team to come to talk to veterans. Well, it's, it's an awesome hour. We get to spend out here, too, just uh, with great men and women that have uh, fought and, and, and worked for our freedoms and, and live in the greatest country in the free world. And we're proud to be Americans and, and proud to be here and spend time with the people that, that made it that way. I know you all have only been in town for a day or so. Uh, thoughts Kansas City so far? Hey, the weather is lovely. Shoot, I was expecting <laughs> to be a little colder, but it's uh, really nice, and uh, we're enjoying ourselves and, and uh, hoping to, uh, you know, put on a good show Saturday night, 5 o'clock. Hope everybody comes out, supports these guys, because it's going to be a big, big time atmosphere and a great game for the D2 National Championship. Yeah, for you guys, uh, first time in school history uh, playing for a national title. No pressure or anything, right? No pressure. You know, they, they told us when we left, we're behind you winter tie. So, uh, you know, we'll see what happens. <laughs> that sounds like uh, folks back in Commerce, uh, last one uh, out, turn the lights off, right? That, that's exactly. Exactly right. They shut down just about every business in town, and uh, shoot, Kansas City's population has swelled with Texans this week. I promise you. Well, this one's been here for about six years, so I guarantee there are a lot more Texans rooting for y'all. So thanks for your time. Good luck to all the guys, and we appreciate you coming on this morning. Thanks so much, Rob. Go Lions. There you go. go. And go Lions for me. And you guys may not know this. This is my alma mater. I graduated from this school back in 1995, back when it was called East Texas State. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> there you go. So... You know who I'm rooting for coming 5 o'clock tomorrow? Yep. I Rob, wish I could be there, but i got to work. I remember you talking about it yesterday, so I'm officially a Lion this week, mm -hmm. and I'm going to be rooting like heck uh, for the Lions this weekend. You got that Texas ring on? Of course. and never take it off. <laughs>